hey what's going on guys welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video um in this video a lot of people have been asking me what my graphics were in terms of my my my, my gta 5 graphics and today i'm gonna kind of show you guys a little bit of a tutorial how i get my graphics to the way i am i really should have recorded this before i put them in but i'm just gonna kind of show you guys how i do it and how i'm doing um i just want to let you guys know my specs are i'm gonna put a list somewhere around here but my specs are um i have a uh amd ryzen 7 5800x so i have a rtx 3080 ti and um i have a ssd which is going to be changing pretty soon and i got like 32 gigs of ram at 3200 megahertz or something like that so those are kind of my specs right now i'm gonna put a list somewhere around here for you guys to see so you guys can go ahead if you guys like this video drop a like comment subscribe turn on notifications so you know when i post this is going to be my updated 2023 graphics version so um i'll let you let me know what you guys think etc etc now i'm both i'm using both the latest quant v and the latest nve the links are going to be in the description down below these are uh paid modificate paid paid assets so you have to pay to get them um so don't be around just saying okay let me go get this for free or let me get on that do this and let's do that you have to pay for it guys you really have to pay for it but um without further ado i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how i put my graphics in etc and uh i'll be back with you y'all all right so um before we go any further i'm gonna guys just show you guys real quick how to get to your 5m version you go to your 5m you right click on it you press open file location and then you go to your 5m application data what i recommend you guys do is you guys click on your 5m application data and then create a shortcut once you create a shortcut uh you can yeah click here create a shortcut when you create a shortcut put that on your desktop and then it makes it easy for easy access okay um but we're gonna just go ahead and go to your to our 5m application data i'm gonna make this kind of wider i'm gonna be in 2k so editing this is gonna be a little bit i, I won't say wonky but um it's it's gonna i'm gonna be doing like some flashes and stuff like that when i say flashes i mean like it's gonna cut 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 if you get what i'm saying but um all right so now we got our graphics in here you, the other thing you're gonna need is to have open iv now i'm gonna just pull up my open iv here for the quant v version you're gonna need open iv okay but what i'm gonna do is show you guys real quick how i do the mods part so we're gonna go over to um 5m application data we're gonna go to mods and then we're also gonna go into my folder which i have the two packages right now we're gonna install the quant v1 first um actually no let's install the mve first because the quant v i actually use quant v's emb um with that being said let's go ahead we're gonna go to main package mods and take everything in there just drag and drop it into the mods folder for nve that's what i do um i'm just gonna just just kind of show you guys how i do it i just literally drag and drop it right there i'm not gonna i don't think i'm gonna replace it but um you guys can go ahead and take the time now to once we go through this to um just copy everything that i got because a lot of people want to use my exact same graphics i don't really understand why but i know they look they look good but at the same time it's like it's like you gotta have your own unique thing but i mean it is what it is once this is over you guys can go ahead and um something just added in there uh i don't remember what i don't know what that is it just added in there oh snowy mountain on chili yeah i don't want that um it's not snowy anymore so i don't i don't really want that um but you can choose whichever ones in there you want uh, how you're gonna do your your system or whatever um me personally i don't like to have um all of those things in there so why is this frozen okay hold on all right that was a little bit weird all right so we're gonna go back out to the 5m application data we're gonna go to plugins right um in the main package there's a new thing for nve called plugins you can go ahead and plug that in um that's i guess that's for you to be able to edit certain stuff in game but i've never actually edited my mve in game so uh i don't know i i, I don't do that but anyways we're gonna go back to the mods 
and we're gonna go to your optional data and you can choose whatever it is you want in here for that you want um i don't use i only use the volumetric clouds for this package i don't actually add the other not nah, actually no i don't use the volumetric clouds for nve i use those for quant v but you can go in here and take whatever you want um i'll leave that up to you just make sure you put it in the right folder it will tell you based on the file which folder you guys want to put it in so um i'm not going to sit here and install it all the time but you guys can see here on the left what i actually have versus what is in the package you guys can go through and figure out which one you want that's going to be it for nve now for quant v this is one you're going to need the open iv right once you guys get your open iv up you're going to go ahead and install um the quant v install right here which is the emb you're also going to go ahead and to do that all you got to do is literally drag and drop mine is being stupid all right i think it's because let me see break operation um, install you just literally drag and drop i don't know why this is doing this but you you basically just drag and drop it and that should be it next thing you need to do you're gonna go into the emb performance i use very high um because my pc is good but it's not like super super good so and then the other stuff that i add in i take away my blood effect because uh youtube and all you got to do is drag and drop put it in your mods folder um i'm gonna if i if this would work i would show you guys how to do it but you just literally drag and drop press install press um mods and then that should be it um metallic paint i use the metallic paint press uh iridescent metal um raindrops i add raindrops from time to time um on the vehicle windshield i don't really like it on the screen but it is what it is if you have a server with the overbloom um effect you guys can fix it here um the starfield galaxy i use these ones um i use the rgb countryside and urban which will be for the city and the county and then i also use the volumetric clouds for quant v and you guys can go in here and choose which one so you put this one in the now let's see if this works optionals 5m app mods and we're gonna just drag and drop this into the folder why is it not copying that's weird all right just drag and drop this into the folder and that would be your 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 clouds um the rest i just put them in there but it's not that mandatory if you guys don't want it um it's fine um once we go in this once i finish this part i'm gonna just go ahead into game and show you guys how i do it in game and the settings that i do i do a couple of settings to um thing i'm not gonna show you exactly what i do guys because i want you guys to go ahead and explore it a little bit and configure it how you feel like this is just the process that i do to put everything in okay so i'm gonna bring you guys back once i get into game all right guys so we're in game now i'm gonna go ahead and change uh this to extra sunny and let's change the time to noon so you guys can see the best of everything i'm gonna just go over here to sandy <laughs> all right <clears throat> so once i get into game in the sandy which i i think personally i need to to change up how my lights look a little bit i want to try to get it to how it was before but uh, it is what it is all right so i'm going to show you guys my in-game settings first so you guys can go ahead and copy those if you if you if it works on your computer but these are currently my in-game settings you can take a screenshot or you can pause it and kind of copy them these are my in-game settings right now and i get between 40 to 60 fps uh solidly okay the next one we're gonna do we're gonna press shift enter you're gonna pull up your emb setting the first thing that i personally do because this is a gta you don't really need a high graphics count right so i lock my fps at 60 fps and these are the settings over here on the left hand side that usually comes with quant v that i keep on but outside of that uh the things that i go ahead and edit is that i go to your emb effect on the right hand side over here i go to the emb effect and um then i scroll down to bright day and i turn that down to 0 0.90 because I, I, there's an overbloom issue a little bit sometimes so that's why i turn it down a little bit 
Uh, we could probably try the overbloom ish the overbloom fix inside of the package, but I don't really want to mess with that. I don't know anything about it. So, um, contrast day. My contrast is up. I bought that at 0 0.70. I might actually buff that up a little bit because um i want my contrast to be pretty good um so i'm gonna buff that up a little bit and then uh once you buff it up just press enter and it should should start um and then i go to bright night i make my bright night nights a little bit brighter because of um when i'm recording and stuff my stuff is very very like dark um it just makes it a little bit better for persons to see at night and during the recording um so let me know what you guys think it's pretty dark but um when i when i buff that up a little bit it makes it look a little bit better um next thing is oh my gosh that's a blue maybe too um and then um might actually take it up a little bit more let's let's take it up a little bit more and then uh my contrast i go ahead and i put that at 0 0.4 to 0 um that's gonna be it for the emb effect i'm gonna show you guys the post processing now which i sharpen my day is at uh 2.30 and then my sharpen night is at two and you guys can go ahead and use that to do whatever you want from it or um it's up to you what you want to do but those are my settings and once i do that i press save configuration and it completely saves okay I know that I speed sped run through this, but I wanted to kind of get this video out for you guys to, to understand. Um, but I want to say thank you guys for all the love and all the support. I figured that this would be the opportune time for me to go ahead and um, give you guys the updated version of my graphics. So everything doesn't seem weird and everything. The EUP is broken. Uh, but yeah hopefully you guys enjoy i'll see you guys next time have a great day have a great week remember after all you guys go to dreams you guys got this i'll see you guys next time peace y'all